We're here at PAX East 2018 with Saskia and Iceberg Interactive checking out Head Snatchers. Now, what is the game about? This game is all about snatching each other's heads, as the name implies. It's a crazy, crazy kind of game, like a mashup between Gang Beasts and those Japanese game shows. You probably know them. Um, you can play with a lot of people, like four people at the same time, local and online. And it's all about snatching each other's heads and scoring points with it in the different stages. There's 25 stages and more than 100 heads to choose from. We got a chance to play the game. Each level is different. Can you go more into that? Yeah, of course. So we have some themed levels that are more like sports. So you have a bowling level, basketball, um, where you have to grab each other's heads and score points with it. But we also have one where we summon Cthulhu, and he's going to kick your friend's asses. If you were friends before, you're probably not friends anymore after you play it. Um, and you have to summon Cthulhu and offer the head to Cthulhu. Uh, we have a level that has the Titanic, where you have to throw each other's heads in a cannon and fire it. We have one with a shark, where you have to feed it to the shark. Uh, I can go on for very long. <laughs> what made you want to make a game that's based off of these heads as like the key to everything really? Well, it's certainly a really funny mechanic. I mean, it's, it's like aggressive, but because the characters are so cute, it has this funny mixture of uh, aggressiveness but also cuteness and that makes it really funny in a way. Also, using the heads uh, makes sure that you can have a lot of your opportunities to play with the game mechanics. I mean, you have a lot of brawlers where you just have to kick each other's ass. When they're down, that's it. And the heads give you more opportunity to experiment with a lot of different gameplay modes. And when is this game coming out? Uh, it's coming out like within the next two months. Uh, we're going to go for a spring release um, and we're going to focus on PS4 and PC right now. And uh, after that, then we're going to see what our options are. I mean, we're still playing with the idea of getting it to Switch and uh, Xbox, of course. Great. Thank you so much, Saskia. Great.